Welcome to the VR Asylum. My name is Paul. I hope everybody is doing well. Today we're going to be looking at five family friendly games you can obviously play with your family. If you're unfamiliar with how the channel works, I'll give you the previews of the five and then I'm going to give you my favorite at the end of it. So enough talking, why don't we jump into the VR Asylum. Virus Popper is a fast-paced educational game about personal hygiene. The developers wanted to make this a fun and friendly way to share important message without adding to the fear and panic of the world right now. Wash your hands in the sink and get cleansed. Pop the virus with powerful disinfectant and sprays. Crush filthiness with legendary weapons like the toilet scrubber. Only you can save the world by practicing safe habits. But how long can you make it in this fun game without getting infected? This game is rated comfortable and is for the ripped and the ripped ass. When the universe is in danger, we send our greatest fighters. But they have failed. So now all we have is you. So shuttle up, brace yourself for a laser shooting, space flying, alien busting experience as you fight your way through the nebula. Unleash strategic power-ups, encounter a variety of enemies, travel through infinite levels, and get ready to get nostalgic in this 8-bit galactical video game. You can import your own nemesis and fight against them in space. Add your own memes or photos and face them head-on, this time with a ship and laser cannon. Nebula Nemesis costs $11.99, is comfortable, and supports the Rift and the Rift S. Sweet Tooth is a light-hearted, family-friendly VR game made for all ages. This game will make you laugh out loud. Fly as a unicorn through the colorful levels collecting candy that increases rainbow power. Unlock new levels and earn trophies by avoiding obstacles and popcorn cannons. This game is $8.99, rated comfortable for the Rift and the Rift S. Next time on VR Asylum. Here we go, pajama party. It's a room. There we go. Oh, much more control now. Well, <laughs> kind of. Perform outstanding maneuvers in this physically simulated fighter. During six missions, you will fight countless enemy fighters, bombers, covert cruisers, and capital ships. This game is 349, is rated moderate, and is for the Rift and the Rift S. Space Blockbuster is a game that takes distinct features of the past reminiscing games into VR. Score higher points at every stage using block patterns, elements, and items that can only be experienced in VR. You can use both the rocket and a ball in your hand to remove obstacles to space travel. Take your headset, prepare your rocket, and get ready to join a journey into deep space. Space Blockbusters is on sale for $7, is rated comfortable, and supports the Rift and the Rift S. We put out two videos every week, so make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and that bell icon to get the latest in VR news, product updates, and of course, gameplay reviews like this one. Okay, so what did I think about these games? All of them are actually a lot of fun, but one stands out more than any and for obvious reasons, and it's called Virus Popper. This one was a lot of fun to play. It's great for the family because it teaches the kids how to wash their hands properly and how to avoid viruses. What each of these tools like toilet cleaners and sprays and all kinds of stuff you can use to kill these viruses. So it makes a lot of sense right now, obviously with the craziness that's going on in this world. It is kind of freaky though. So when the viruses actually stick to the brush and stick to your hand and stuff, it does, 
you know, it, it kind of weirds you out a little bit. So that one was my favorite. I'm actually gonna give it a rating of three out of five straight jackets. This one was, it was, was a lot of fun. It's a kid's game. That's why it's getting three out of five. And it's, you know, it's a pretty simplistic way of looking at how to defend yourself against viruses. So it was a lot of fun and I think it's an appropriate game. So I suggest you guys check it out. I'm sure you guys will have fun with it too. Leave a comment down below and let me know which game you think is going to be a big hit out of the five. All right, thanks very much for watching guys. We'll see you next time on VR Asylum.